This is a 79-year-old patient referred for endoscopic staging of an adenocarcinoma at the gastroesophageal junction. This patient has a small hiatus hernia. The tumor measures 20 millimeters in the maximal diameter and is located one centimeter proximal of the cardia. In patients with small hernias, complete visualization and evaluation of this location is often difficult in the prograde position of the endoscope. After inversion of the endoscope, we can clearly see the neoplastic nodule in the direct neighborhood of the cardia. Tumors like this, which have centers within 5 cm of and extend to the gastroesophageal junction, are classified as esophageal carcinoma, while other tumors that have their centers more than 5 cm distal of the gastroesophageal junction are classified as gastric carcinoma. According to the Sievert classification, this is a type 2 tumor, classified as true carcinoma of the gastric cardia, arising from the cardiac epithelium or short segments with intestinal metaplasia at the gastroesophageal junction. Endoscopic ultrasound using electronic radial endoscopic ultrasonography reveals an irregular hypoechoic mass that infiltrates the muscularis propria but does not penetrate it. This invasion depth is classified as a T2 tumor. However, the arrow points to a small area that is suspicious for a transmural invasion through the esophageal wall. Enlarged local lymph nodes are not detected. The final endosonographic diagnosis in this patient is T2 or T3 tumor without lymph node invasion. The patient refused combined modality therapy and underwent surgery alone, with a final diagnosis of an adenocarcinoma of the gastroesophageal junction, PT2, PN0, 0 over 24, M0, International Union Against Cancer Classification Type IB, with no indication of an adjuvant treatment.